If you want to get started with YouTube videos, you're in the right place. We will go over why create videos, planning, recording, editing, and uploading. I will be going over the absolute basics to get started. If you want me to go deeper on any topic, please let me know in the comments or find me in my Discord, linked in the description below. So why make videos? Well, creating videos is an important part of any gaming community. Making videos that you find fun and entertaining keeps the community active and engaged, and also shows new players why they should come and try it out. If you have been playing WoW for a while, you'll probably remember how much of an impact the World of Warcraft South Park episode had on the game. Leroy Jenkins would be another example. World of Warcraft is way more complicated than a first-person shooter or MOBA game, so sharing what you have learned to be more efficient greatly helps the learning curve for newer players. It's also a great way to share feedback and keep a discussion among players which, in an ideal world, developers use to shape their game. This is a large reason why we got Classic WoW and Season of Discovery in the first place. Now planning. So first we're going to go over choosing a niche. When you're starting to make World of Warcraft videos on YouTube, the first big step is to pick what kind of videos you want to make. This is called finding your niche. Your niche should be a part of WoW that you really like and know a lot about. This could be anything like guides for raids, PvP, or game lore. My favorite videos back in the day were videos like Illegal Danish, where it's just a funny made up story. A League of Legends player Rav also has a good series going on right now, so you should go check that out. The best niche for you is something that you love, are good at, and would not be a chore to continue making videos about it. And the second thing about planning is, after you start making videos, see what your viewers say. If they like some videos more than others, think about making more like those. Always be ready to try new things with your videos to make your viewers happy, but still make videos about what you love and wow. Now for recording. I'm going to preface this by saying that when I first started making videos, I was doing it on a around 1000 refurbished MSI gaming laptop, so definitely do not let your computer specs stop you from starting. If anything, you should see it as a challenge that will only make you a better YouTube creator down the road. However, I will not lie, I just got a very good PC setup recently and it definitely makes the YouTube recording, editing, and uploading process so much better. So let's talk about what you need for recording, a good computer setup, and the right software. So having a good computer is really important. You need a computer that could play WoW and record your game at the same time without any problems. This means that you need a good CPU, enough RAM to do many things at once, and a strong graphics card. My PC specs that I'm running is for the CPU I have a Intel i9, the graphics card is Nvidia RTX 3090, my RAM, I have 4 16 gigabytes of RAM for a total of 64 gigabytes of RAM. My microphone is the Razer Siren V2. My monitor is a Samsung 28 inch Odyssey. And my external solid state drive is a Samsung T7 4 terabytes. And that external solid state drive is where I put all of my content. The videos take up a lot of memory and that external solid state drive is just so helpful when like for all the uploading, all the recording, just everything in general. I also linked all of those parts in the description below if you guys wanted to go check that out. The software for recording for the video capture, I use a GeForce Experience because I have the NVIDIA graphics card. GeForce Experience is a great choice. It lets you record your game without making WoW run slow at all. And the second option is OBS, which is Open Broadcaster Software. OBS is another great option for recording your WoW gameplay. It works with NVIDIA and AMD graphics cards, and it's free. OBS is really popular because you can change a lot of settings to make your videos look just how you want them. So remember, for recording your WoW videos, you need a good computer that can handle both playing the game and recording it. And you need to pick a recording program like GeForce or OBS that works well with your computer and does what you need. This way you can make great videos that look smooth and clear. Now editing your videos. So editing your WoW videos is super important. It's where you make your videos fun and interesting to watch. Mr. Beast is a famous YouTuber known for his content and he says that the audience is the algorithm. So in YouTube, people are really obsessed with the algorithm that it's the algorithm's fault whether your video gets played or not, gets clicked on or not, but that really isn't the case. Instead of thinking about the algorithm, Think about it as the audience. Does the audience like my video? Does the audience like my title? Does the audience like the thumbnail? 
Do they like it enough that they're going to click it? Do they like it enough to watch it all the way through? And also think about it from YouTube's perspective. Why would they put out a video that no one clicks on? And even if they do click on it, the audience is only there for less than three seconds and then they just click off. No, of course not. They're going to go for the most engaging, most clickable videos. And that is how you should think about this. It's better to think about it as audience. Keep it engaging. The most important part of the video is the first 30 seconds. Your video should grab viewers attention right from the start and keep it. To do this, you have to get straight to the point or provide value very quickly. Don't spend too long on one scene and keep things moving to hold your audience's interest. Cut out the boring parts. Watch your video and cut out any parts that are slow or not interesting. You want every second of your video to be entertaining or useful. If a part of the video doesn't add anything exciting or important, it's probably best to leave it out. Use good music and sound effects. Background music and sound effects can really make your video more fun to watch. Choose music that fits the mood of your video. Sound effects can be used for humor or to highlight something important in the game. Add text and graphics. Using text and graphics to explain things or add humor. This can be really helpful if you're showing how to do something in WoW or just making a joke. Pay attention to the pacing. Pacing is how fast your video moves along. You don't want it to be too slow or too fast. Find a good balance that keeps your viewers interested. End with a call to action. At the end of your video, ask viewers to like, comment, and subscribe. This interaction is important because it tells YouTube that people like your videos. For example, if you've been finding this at all helpful to making YouTube videos for World of Warcraft, please like and subscribe. All that would be greatly appreciated. And finally, quality over quantity. It's better to make one really good video than lots of okay ones. Spend time making your video the best it could possibly be. And now uploading, we'll start with titles. You want to use a title that grabs the attention, but it's not clickbait. You want people to be like happy that they clicked on your video and creating clickbait titles really pisses people off. And it also has them clicking away the instant that they see that your video is just a lie. So it's best to have a title that grabs attention, but it actually says what it's going to do. Also create thumbnails that stand out. Bright colors, bold text, and a hint of what your video is about can definitely make it stand out from the crowd and get people to click on it. Lastly, watch your analytics. After you post your video, see how people are reacting. YouTube's analytics can tell you which parts people like and which parts they don't. Use this info to make your next videos even better. The ones to pay attention to is click-through rate, meaning how likely are people going to see your video and want to click on it, and also audience retention, which is how long an average viewer watches your video. These are a little more advanced tactics, but if you want to get better at making YouTube videos, getting these two metrics better with every video you make will be the best thing to focus on. Remember, it's all about making your videos easy to find and engaging for your audience. I want to keep this beginner friendly, so I will stop it there. And to summarize, find your niche, pick a part of WoW you love and know a lot about, get your recording set up right, a solid PC and the right software, engaging editing, keep it fun, cut the boring parts and use cool effects, stand out with your upload, use catchy titles, engaging thumbnails and SEO tricks, stay engaged, chat with your viewers and keep them coming back for more. WoW is in a great place and we will need new content creators to keep us going into the future. If you found this guide helpful, please hit the like and subscribe button. And my last advice is do not overthink it. Go get started.